everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. In this video, we are going to be trying out a brand. That brand, you may ask, is Boohoo. Why was that so awkward? I've got like five things to say before I even get into this, so if you don't care, I understand. Just skip to now, this. First things first, my face doesn't really match my neck because, as you guys know, I'm making a fake tanner video and I forgot that I fake tanned last night, so I put on my lighter foundation and then I was like, wait a second, I fake... So, it's... it's... there's a difference. Second thing, my Snapchat and my YouTube both got verified this week and I am so excited about it. It feels like validation and I just am really happy about it, so I just wanted to address that. I'm so... Third thing, we hit 800,000, absolutely insane. I cannot thank you guys enough. Like, it just, I instantly get emotional. <sighs> I don't wanna, I don't wanna get into it, but it's a dream and every milestone is just like furthering that and it just, it means a lot. So thank you guys. Last thing, which I forgot to say because I hadn't filmed the video yet, but I am doing a giveaway of the Morphe Vault those four palettes. So if you guys want to enter that, go over to my Instagram or my last video because there's info on that. And I think that's everything. So I think we can get into this video. So as you guys know, if you know Boohoo, their website has a lot of items. To shop on their website is not difficult. You can find pretty much anything you want on there. So Boohoo does sponsor a lot of YouTubers and work with YouTubers, but this video they are not working with me for. I just decided to make this order on their website and make this video because you guys have been asking about it. Honestly, even if it was a sponsorship, I would be honest, but I'm just putting it out there that it's not. So here is the humongous bag of stuff I got off Boohoo. Um, I think they have sales quite a bit too, so if you are thinking about buying from them, I suggest like checking their website once in a while because a lot of times they'll have like 30% off the entire store or something like that so um just so you know also I didn't have to pay customs on this package and also the shipping took about two weeks I stopped saying that in these types of videos and you guys were like why'd you stop and I was like why did I stop so yeah I'll put that in there but okay let's get started okay so the first item is big and it's actually a pair of shoes so I'll talk about them first. The more I do these videos the more I think it's really important to buy things from a lot of different categories so I do want to always make sure to buy like a pair of shoes and it just so happened I wanted these shoes so it says on the box crush since 1970 so obviously it doesn't say boohoo on the box I don't know if they outsource. Oh my goodness I love these so I got mine in a size 4. What? I'm pretty sure these are a six and a half. Maybe there's a conversion size that makes these a four because I think this might be a UK brand, but wouldn't that have made it a 36? Anyway, so here are these shoes. As you can see, they are like these booty little heels and they've got like lots of grip on the bottom and why this looks dirty is because I actually wore them in my copying Alyssa Violet's Instagram video, so I have seen these before. There's actually two items I've already seen. Being from Canada where it does snow and it gets icy, I really like the fact that these have some heavy duty grip to them just because when I wear heels and it's like slippery, that's like really scary, so I like these. Um, they don't feel super like lined on the inside, so I don't think they do much insulating, but I really like them. They feel super heavy duty, so I will show you what they look like on, but like I said, I have tried them on. They do fit good, but I'll show you. Oh my gosh, my fake tanner looks awful. I'm also wearing sweatpants, so which looks worse, a bad fake tan or the sweatpants? Anyway, they fit great. I really like these boots. Here's what they look like. Enough is enough. The next thing that I'm going to talk about is going to be the other item that I have already tried on and then after this one all of it is going to be new to me but this one I have tried on because if you saw my vlog from LA you know I actually wore a two-piece from Boohoo and that is this one. I ordered it in this group. So it is like this pinstriping kind of tube top style but it's got straps and then the pants are very high-waisted, so if you saw those pictures, you saw this set. And a lot of you were asking about it, so I will link all of these items down below. But yeah, so I got this. I'll try it on, but you guys have probably already seen it if you've seen that, so. So like I was saying about this two-piece, 
it's so comfortable i know my face is like cut off but i'm just trying to show my whole look and i'm hoping my feet aren't in them but i'm pretty sure yep they are i'm wearing my adidas slides you already know but okay so these pants feel like sweatpants they are super stretchy they go up they kind of like hold you in i really do like the two double pleats right here that go both ways the top is very snug so if you're gifted up top you might need to size up for the sake of that but it also is pretty stretchy i absolutely love it it is so comfy 10 out of 10 so happy I wore this. All right, pulling this out of the bag, I can already tell what this is. This is a mini dress that I bought. Ooh, okay, I was not expecting this to feel like this. It feels kind of like athletic leggings, very stretchy. I love this pattern. This checkers, like these checkers are like so eye-catching. I will try that on, and by the way, I got everything in a small, so. All right, one thing I'm really noticing about this is because it's kind of this thick athletic legging feeling dress it feels like it kind of holds you in kind of like how people say certain leggings that are very thick and like taut will hold you in that's kind of how this dress feels so for a bodycon dress that's very good because usually bodycon dresses kind of like emphasize when you've eaten something you know what i mean whereas this one feels like it's trying to help you one thing though is i do wish the straps were adjustable because i could see them Kind of like falling off because they are a little bit loose i think if i was going to go to an event in la again maybe i would wear this i'm never gonna get over it best day ever so i don't know what this is what are these oh okay so these are joggers aka sweatpants they look a lot like sweatpants and down the side they say woman they feel a little bit thin i can see through them but i think that they're gonna be good so i'll put those on i'm always trying to further my sweatpant collection so thought i better not gonna lie i don't love these i think they do feel a little bit thin and kind of tight in the wrong places they feel tight around my knees which is weird because like why do they feel tight around my knees? And I think if you were gifted in the thickness, these would look a lot less odd on you because I think for me, since I am pretty straight down, the high-waisted kind of just gives me not much, which is weird because usually I like high-waisted, but I think these are kind of just swallowing me up. And I know you don't really wear joggers to get like an amazing shape, but I just think these were kind of cut weird for my body shape. What is this? Oh, I can remember this instantly. So this is a bodysuit and it looked like a race car kind of sort of inspired bodysuit. 1995 Beverly Hills, California. Love Beverly Hills. Take me back. It's not a thong back, so you might have an underwear line. Of course it clips. This zips down. It feels honestly kind of like a jersey, so okay, let's put this on. I really like the way this looks. So I decided to roll down the sweatpants just a little bit because I think they kind of hide everything, so I'll just pull them down. Bodysuit wise, it's long enough for my torso. We have had that problem before where a bodysuit's cut for short torsos. Again, I stick behind the jersey material or like in gym class, did you guys ever wear like pinnies? This feels like a thick penny. The zipper works. I don't exactly know where I would wear this, but I think that in my lifetime, I will be in a situation where I'm like, where's my bodysuit? That would be perfect. These look a lot like sweatpants. I wouldn't be surprised if I did buy two pairs of sweatpants, so. Yep, sure enough, these are a pair of gray sweatpants with a white stripe and also a red stripe on the back. These feel super soft. They feel just like the ones I'm wearing right now. Yeah, not much to say about these. Once again, size small. Oh, it says like, oh, okay. These sizes are like UK size six, US size two. So I guess I got the pants in a US size two. All right, these fit a lot better than those other black sweatpants. Um, they are super high-waisted though. Like, what is the deal? <laughs> Oh my goodness, why did I just pull that up so high? It feels like the cut is just so high up. Like, why are they going this high? Super soft though. I do like them. I think maybe they were made to be rolled down. 
because I think that's like a style or something now. So they are very high-waisted, but if you're not against rolling your sweatpants down, they'll work. I already know what this is. I got a black bodysuit. I loved the way this one looked because I like the thicker on the shoulders if I want to wear a bra with it. Here is what it looks like. It just looks pretty basic, so I'll put it on. I love this shirt. It fits amazing. I think the only pointer I would give, pointer. Okay, boohoo, I know you didn't ask, but thong body suits. I usually prefer but I mean it's not the end of the world especially because this is pretty thin I don't think it would leave like that big of a line but I do love this I like the neckline I like how it doesn't go super super low next I got a pair of jeans these looked amazing on the website I was very very much drawn in I really like the color of these jeans I don't know I like all colors of jeans but the light wash is a little bit light and then the dark wash is a little dark i really like the medium wash these are supposed to be high-waisted i'm like praying they fit me because i really loved the way they looked on the model so i'm hoping so i don't usually throw around the word perfect but these pants for me are absolutely perfect firstly they're like cropped they're rolled up and that's like the perfect crop length there's no gapping in the back and they're fitting my waist perfectly without being too big or too small like I wouldn't need a belt but I also can breathe if you like these 10 out of 10 try them out I love these I'm gonna be wearing these all the time and also they do look good with this black shirt next thing is a purple kind of like sport skirt it's basically the fabric of sweatpants but a skirt so what I'm looking for in life is everything but sweatpants so this is one of those it's in this beautiful purple feels really soft just feels like it'll be really comfy hopefully I could dress it up with like a white crop top or something I definitely don't have anything like this and I don't know why I never did it's like a sweatpants skirt and everyone knows long skirts that don't fly up are pretty comfortable this one's very long it goes to my fingertips and it's not, it's like thick enough that it wouldn't fly up randomly, which I really do like. And it kind of matches my wig. Wow, she's a purple queen. Oh, I hate myself. Oh my goodness. When you can't help but match your skirt to your hair. Wow, I did not realize I got so many pants. Yeah, okay, so I got these pants. They're kind of like trousers. They've got this plaid look to them. They look like they'll be a little big on the waist, but hopefully not. Okay, things are so deceiving because when I was holding these, I definitely thought the waist was gonna be way too big, but now that I have it on, it fits me perfectly. They're definitely not high-waisted. They fall a little bit lower, but they're not low either. They're like in between. I'm so happy these fit because I feel like for business reasons, I should have a pair of business pants. Okay, I didn't realize that I saved a swimsuit for last. And the swimsuit's like a really, really loud print, but I mean, for some reason I must have liked it. It's very, very loud. I think it's because I had so many solid print bikinis. I was like, let's be crazy. And here are the bottoms. Okay, let's try it on. The back covers a lot of the boot. They're both ties. The real only issue I see is that with this pattern, you're like asking people to be like, wow, that's a, that's a vibrant pattern. Let me take a look. <laughs> same. No, no. No, no, same. No. Me too. Me too. I would like to wear just like one color and just kind of fade off. Don't look at me, please. Okay, now that I'm back fully dressed in my sweater. Judging by the clothing, they look very similar to the pictures. The sizes seem legit. So anyone who is curious about it, I would confidently tell you not to worry and if you like something order it i'm actually super super happy with everything i got i could see myself wearing all of those items i point there because they're right there <laughs> but yeah thank you guys for suggesting this i'm really happy i tried out this brand if there's any other brands you want me to try or more from this anything just let me know down below thank you so much for watching i love you guys so much and i will see you guys in the next one bye